bit of Indian takeaway, she'd be in front of it, and just these flavours and smells, I'd be salivating, absolutely starving. And it was, I think it was the first time I ever saw a nan bread. And I used to think, they look incredible. What job for you tea? What job for you tea? What's for Tea with Mike Newell? Hello, welcome to What's for Tea with Mike Newell, episode eight. Is it eight? It's eight. We did two without you, Will, but you're in my bubble. Uh, although, you know, we're still uh, two metres apart, got a good lens. I'm zoomed in, yeah. Zoomed in. Not, not a Zoom meeting, though, eh? Huh? Uh, today we're going to do some, I'm going to do some fusion cooking. Uh, going to make curry lasagna. What do you think to that? I mean, if I'm honest, it sounds awful. It's but gonna, Yeah, well, it's something me and my mate came up with many moons ago and I still can't believe like you can't get it at Iceland or, you know, if someone's not mass produced it. Uh, my mate John Bowden. I, can't, I think it was his idea, actually, but we're like, yeah, light lasagna, love curry. Curry lasagna, like a, a madras inside it. Um, so, yeah, kind of cheated. Have you ever... I was chatting to my mate recently. Have you ever had uh, lasagna with curry instead of... Uh, <laughs> Uh, I've heard of it. You heard have it. heard of it, yeah? I've heard of it, yeah, because I'm Asian, yeah. I would call it, I think my mate's You don't make it? No, I wasn't me, because I wasn't trying to think like that, but... Alright, pal. Cheers. Oh, See you in a bit. Bye-bye. I've got a sag paneer, and then I've got a mince one, which is kima. Um, uh, gel fraser heat. So it should be good. I've never made a lasagna, so... <laughs> Basically... He said Boona, and I thought, oh, that's what it is. It only does it in Boona, but it's basically the kima is the meat. So you could have a, a kima, Jal Frazee, which I've got, you could have a kima. Vindaloo, you could have a kima, Korma. There we go. That's the mince kima, yeah. So it does look like um, bolognese, doesn't it? A little bit. These are bastard when you get oil on, on like your surfaces. Yeah, this is gonna be perfect. Do you remember? Um, my dad used to do them. They, they were awful. Um, you used to get um, poppadoms that you'd make yourself. Do you remember these? I'm just getting the the lasagna. So my first experience with curry was just what like my mum and dad would make, which would be like not even a jar of sauce. It was like a paste, and it was always, it was always they always made it with beef. Oh my god, nearly perfect size. Uh, and then my dad used to get this frying pan that you do like your eggs in, well, a frying pan. Um, and he'd fill it with hot um, oil. And then it, that, these poppadoms were like that. They were actually like that, but they were circular. And you put them in, <laughs> and they just used to like expand and crisp up. And he'd be like wrestling with them with like, like spatulas to try and keep them down. They were always overcooked. They were always like filled, you know, like fried bread where you can just taste the oil. Do fucking ming it. Is this what you do with it? This is difficult. I don't know how I'm gonna make it. So we're trying, um, trying to cut the, trying to cut the lasagna slices to the sack. The actual. Oh my god. What about like that? Right, oh for fuck's sake. Um, just stop filming. How do you cut these to size? <laughs> we, took, we, we always say we'll try and make these a bit shorter, don't we? And then shit like this happens. Me and John, we used to go for curries all the time and then we were probably drunk when we said this might be a good idea. Just get a little piece. Paneer now it's a bit lumpier, isn't it? Right, so this is this is the fourth, isn't it? One, two, three, yes, four, yeah. You don't end on a lasagna sheet, do you? And this is a uh, cheap, cheap this. 
I've just been told that I know off the guy that they don't use dairy products in Indian um, cuisine, but I mean we've said it before and I'll say it again, well they're geared. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, your timer is set for twenty. We I've just been told that um they don't cook with cheddar, so oh, what? they don't cook with dairy. Oh my god, it looks incredible. Don't it? it does actually look really good. <laughs> looks like it's expanded. It held well, didn't it? Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if it's good or not. <laughs> it really works. I'm not lying. It's delicious. It's absolutely delicious. I mean, obviously you wouldn't have naan bread or rice. Maybe, maybe a barge on the side. Get in. Right, you can eat yours now, pal. What did you have for your tea? What did you have for your tea? What's for tea with Mike Newell?